No, I, I just think it's those three things. I think with um, don't think it, don't go, you know, moping through that it happened to you because it didn't. You've you've got everything you've taken for granted and given in your life, and the way that you've gone through life, uh, that doesn't change. Um, but it is going to be a different experience for your boy or your your girl in that situation. So you have an increased level of responsibility as a parent to get stuck in and there's no quick fix there's no uh, solution there's no customized fit that's going to make it all just suddenly uh, you know go away and be better from that what what it is is just good old-fashioned um, hard work and good old-fashioned parenting of spending time um, and sometimes that can be pretty frustrating for you to get in other days it's it's equally and, and, and most of the time really a, a beautiful experience. So you have to get to that space, I think, quickly. And um, you know, as we talked about, I think Joe snapped me out of my inertia and got me on the, on the right road. And I think it came back to the fact that if you like the person you were before it happened, get stuck in immediately before you turn into you know, potentially someone you, you might not or a parent you wouldn't like, um, because that would be tragic. And you, you, you're very lucky to have that boy or that girl regardless of how they've come into the world. Um, and they're going to give you a hell of a lot more back than what you're going to basically put into them, however hard it is in the first 10 years. That's just the reality of it. So that you should look at in, always in an optimistic and a wonderful way because it is.